Well, welcome back from that short break, and you have been joined in the studio by our second guest. He's a lead singer of the famous uh, music group with us, the Battle Choir, and this is Osborne Agbodovi, who is now gone solo. <laughs> <laughs> Good afternoon to you. Good afternoon to you. Good afternoon. Good to see you. Yeah. Good to have you here as well. And I love the song. Very Thank nice you. song. Quite yeah. simple. Yeah, very simple to right. sing. Thank you. <laughs> but how, how does it feel to, you know, now be a solo artist? Um, it's an honor to, right. to, to step up to the limelight, to, to spread the word of God through music. And I thank God for the leadership of my ministry, Better Revival Choir, and the church Global Evangelical Church, they have been a great support to me. And it's an honor to serve Ghana and to serve the world. Thank mm. you. Okay. All right, that's great. But, but then again, you know, tell us a bit about you. Some already know you, definitely. Okay. You know you've been doing good um, in that section with Bethel Revival okay. Music Choir. Now, tell us more about you, those, for those who do not know much. <laughs> <laughs> okay, as you said, uh, by God's grace, I'm the, one of the lead vocalists of Bethel Revival Choir, the lead singers of mm. Bethel Revival Choir. I'm a songwriter too. Okay. And um, um, what else can I say? <laughs> like how long have you been around? Right. Yeah, so I've almost for 10 years now. Oh, 10 wow. years? And still um, more than 10 years, yeah. Hey. <laughs> so you have been around for a very long time. Yeah. But uh, um, this ministry is a journey. Um, so you start from somewhere to before you get somewhere. Okay. So I started uh, as early as uh, five. Five and years. in our church, we have a system, a church system. So you go through the teens, the children's choir, you go mm. through the teens choir before you join Better mm -hmm. Revival mm -hmm. Choir. So I started as early as five, so I followed that routine to where till now. Mm. So it's almost more than 15 years. Oh, so, so you have been in the church too for a very long, long time. Long time. So I grew up in the church. Loyal. Yeah, wow. yeah. No, That's as, good as to see. Yeah, right. right. Okay, you know that. Right. That was, yeah, our church is. <laughs> right. EP. Mm -hmm. uh, global. Uh -huh. yeah. uh, you know, all the others. Uh, yeah. Uh, but, you know, you, you spoke about writing songs as well. Have you written songs for others that have come out over time? Or what songs have you been writing, really? Yeah. So by God's grace, I've written two songs for the choir. Oh, okay. okay. Yeah, a song like um, Yao. Okay. Yao. And recently, um, Nyemakuo. I did that one with, I did Nyemakuo with um, Pastor Isaiah Fusukwache. Oh, okay, okay. And I did okay. Yao with Luigi McLean. Oh, wow. Ah, yeah. I, know, I, know, I know the songs. Right. Yes, yeah, so I, know, I know the songs. Those are, by God's grace, those are my two songs for the choir. Hmm. Yeah. Really you, are, you are attached to the choir yeah. that you've been around for a very long time. I, I, I thought I was going to ask you. <laughs> I thought that it was really nice of them, you know, um, releasing that statement. And, and you see the statement on the screen in a bit about, about you leaving. And when you saw that, how did you feel? <laughs> yeah. Um, I'm not really, really leaving as leaving. Mm -hmm. I'm still part yeah, of... Of course, like as a yeah, solo, solo. I'm still no, part yeah. of the choir. Mm -hmm. And since Better Revival Choir is a church choir and it's part of a church system, yeah. and I'm equally part of the church, church. so automatically I'm still, I'm still in the church. But alongside, I'll still be running this ministry as solo artist yeah. alongside. Oh, no, but I, I understand you, but you know a lot of people join groups and when they've got to go... So, when you've got to go solo, sometimes it's own way. Yeah. But when your group stands behind you and mm. says that we are supporting with our full weight, that's, that's yeah, it's, it's a it's a very awesome experience. I was really blown out. I was like, whoa! And I thank God for the life of um, the leadership. They have been a great, great, great support um, to me personally, and they've really, really pushed hard for me to to get to this point. And I'm really, really, really uh, grateful for that. Thank okay. You. Good to hear, but you know, you have a new one, that's who you are, and you have Joe Metal on it. I mean, there are a lot of, uh, Joe Metal is great, there are a lot of other gospel musicians that you could equally, you know, have them on this particular one, but you decided to be on with Joe Metal. Why Joe Metal? Okay, thank you. So, um, we had a program somewhere last two years in Togo. Mm -hmm. okay. We did Togo in worship, the Better right. Revival Choir, and Joe Metal, by God's grace, won, was on the bill. And so, we decided to recall this song during that program. Oh, wow. And so we recorded this song in the account of Bethel. So it was on Bethel stage that we recorded this song. Oh, okay. Yeah. Okay. So um, Joe Metal was there and he was pre-informed about the song long time. So 
He knew about it and he just yes. did his thing. Yeah. Did you write that song by Yes, yourself? I wrote that song. Yes. yes. Okay. And, and I'm intrigued very, about the lyrics very, though, very, very. Um, because I say, yeah, not, sometimes lyrics are not dull song. You know, <laughs> other times it's a dull song. See, even when you were talking, the beat and the holy, holy, mm. that is like, I can't meet him. No. Yeah. Was yeah. intentional. Was intentional to make it very simple that everybody will be able to sing along. Okay, so um, the truth about this song is I, I woke up with this song in my dream. I was literally singing as a congregation in my dream. I was singing. Okay. I woke up with, with this mm. around 2 p.m. So I have to take my phone and record it. And record it. So uh, thankfully on rehearsals, uh, on the day of rehearsal, I decided to teach the choir. Okay. So that uh, the following day we can teach the congregation and we just sing it among wow. ourselves. So. Um, from there, we taught the choir, and it was it was it was a blessing. So I realized that ah, since it can bless the church, let's let us put it out like there to, mm, wow. to to bless the nation. And yeah. definitely look like I mean, you know, just on the 11th of February, it's still catching up. It's already catching up yeah. with people. People yeah. are you know hopping into it, and yeah. I think it's already blessing. So, so thank God. I think the mission is getting accomplished, <laughs> right? Yeah, 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 the mission is getting accomplished <laughs> right. to, to go everywhere. But yeah. you know, what's you know, apart from this, what are we looking out for from you? What should we expect? Okay. Um, I, I wish to expect an album or something like. Yeah, that. God willing, we are planning to 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 record an album. Okay. So, uh, we are looking at um, somewhere June. June, the mm -hmm. date will be out, but somewhere June, and um, we have some couple of songs to release to to record to bless the church of Amazing. God, yeah, the body of Christ. Thank really, you. Really do you see how, how do you see this journey? Um, of course, you've been in the space with Bethel for a minute, but. Um, now, if you've got to do things by yourself, it's yeah. different from if you're in a group. <laughs> How are you planning to make sure that you, you're able to roll on, you know, persistently? Okay, so um, thank you. I, I have a good management team okay. right behind me or solid behind me. And I believe with the help of them, and you're going to sail through. I know it's not going to be easy, but the more the challenges come, we'll be able to sail through. It's a ministry. And we are here. It's a it's a it's a soul business. It's not a, a one man thing. It's a it's a soul business. So in as much as we can, we can go there and be a blessing to to the people out there. Okay. okay. I mean, just before we go, I know a lot of gospel musicians have different opinions when it comes to um, having shows and you know taking money. We just spoke to Niabe, who <laughs> you know have his own thoughts. What of you? What do you think really? Is it okay to charge for a gospel program? Mm -hmm. Okay, um, for me personally, I feel, it's my opinion, I feel it's not, um, it, it shouldn't be a big deal because um, we need money to, to, to mm -hmm. run projects. Run projects. As I'm saying, I have to record some albums. I need some money. sort of money yeah. to do yeah. that. And it's capital intensive. And you can't do this by yourself. You need money to, watch, to, yeah. to do the, that to put the work out there so um with this work of ours by god's grace you can't really appreciate appreciate as the only thing you can do is just to support yeah so when the program comes there's a ticket yeah just your way of saying thank you yeah. for putting the work out there it's for the right. kingdom yes. it's for the kingdom right. you have to charge right. Right. whichever and way you give. charge they will come yeah. right. they have to come <laughs> Of course. Yeah, in church, we give anyway, so it's not, it's yeah, not bad to yeah. appreciate the gospel music. I hear the gospel you know, artists of a church. Uh, you, you know, bigger. look at other artists who are secular. The money they charge. Quite a hundred Ghana. You know, it's, it's really cool. So, Oswald, yeah. Oswald will right. organize his course and charge. We'll yeah, you have to go. You have to go <laughs> in order to be blessed. But it's been really exciting yeah. having you here. Any other thing you want to add before we go? Thank you. Yeah, so by God's grace, I want to say a big thank you to the church okay. and to the leadership of Better Revival Choir. I'm so, so grateful. And to all my loved ones, let's go, let's stream, let's share, let it be a As you said, it's mm. a simple song. You can use them. Yeah. You can use it whilst you are praying your quiet time. Pray into it, and I believe that God will meet you at the point of your need. It's Osborne Agbudovi on all social media handles and all streaming platforms too. Awesome. Great. Thank you very much for passing through this afternoon. Thank you. I'm yeah. so grateful. Right. All right. So check him out on all the platforms. Right. Osborne Agbo Dovi. Yeah. On all, which month were you born in? Pardon me? Which month were you born? May. Oh. Oh. <laughs> it's okay. We'll manage. We'll manage. Right. <laughs> Thank you very much, Osborne.